Sun Valley and I met Mary and uh, we hit it off. I'd read Liars Club and I was struck by the very boldness of and the ability to confront uh, her past with such uh, openness. Cherry had, had a big impact on me because you know we go through this adolescence that uh, is filled with how to deal with life situations and the stiltedness of the awkward age the boldness of dealing with that and the emotions and memories around that were remarkable because most of that is covered and scabbed over and it's very difficult to lift all those off and, and uh, analyze that. It is about moving past the pain of, of growing into how to be an adult, how to mature and moving forward through all your foible little issues that go on to big issues that end up into divorce and loss. As I received Mary's book, I was reading almost each chapter like a Dharma talk uh, about how to get back to your past and how to have a voice and how to deal with hard situations. Uh, it's almost a therapy in motion. I think the chapter on developing a voice is also extremely helpful to people that are writers that there's a certain cadence and way of writing that is so important to developing a voice that can be heard. Mary obviously has done that and has a, the ability to capture a reader. But the idea of developing a voice, of, of everything is um, subjective. There's no such thing as objectivity. We all rely on our past and we all rely on our own experiences. This book relates to all types of writing. Usually whenever we read something we ingest it and it comes back as colored and tainted by our own experiences. So this book cuts through that and gives us an opportunity to really look at things in the most beautiful way.